Hey everyone, this is Luke again, and welcome back to The Room 2. So, let's continue. We were like, part of the way through the second or so chapter, because I don't count the tutorial chapter of the game. So, yeah. Where were we? Oh yeah, it was the, it was this thing. Yeah, there was like a code, and if you unlock the code... Okay, so I did something. Wait a minute. Wait a second. Okay, I think I, I remembered. It was like some sort of spot. Basically, there was some sort of spots, and you have to... Oh, yeah, there was the dagger. There was the dagger right there. Wait a minute. Let me see. I think, um, where, where was the, um, there was a code in here that told you how to switch between the two? No, that wasn't it. That ain't it. Yeah, that. There's it. There it is. I think it was, um, Okay, yeah, you have to go to the mirror, and then you have to, it was the mirror, and you have to click the, uh, top, the top of the mirror. <laughs> it was, uh, the two C's, and the, uh, one of these. Yeah, that one. Because, um... There was a, uh... The dagger must belong somewhere in either of the boxes on the central table. Um, there was, like, something here. There was something here. Oh, it was there. It was here. It was this thing right here. So, the top left, the one on the r far right, and the one third from the, uh, unless it's backwards, unless it's backwards. It was like, I remember the other one was like the, uh, it was like a, it was like a weird looking symbol, it was, it was like, well, no, I should want to see it, no, nope, not that. Not that, I don't think. <laughs> I think that was it. Yeah. I could change the mirror symbol to swap between the two boxes to find a place for the dagger, alright? So, it was, uh, oh, there's a gem missing. So where is it? Where's that gem? Wait, does the dagger go in here? I think so. No, not there. Central table. So yeah, this is central table. So.
if I change to reveal the wooden box, I'll be able to fit this dagger in the slot on the top. Okay, so I have the wrong one. It was the one that looked like a target and the cross. So, cross, where is it? Yep, this, and then the one that looks like a target. Nope. What? Oh, no, it was the two C's. Whoops. I got the symbols. There it is. This is the wooden one. This is the wooden one. Slide the top, yeah. There's the dagger. And a small gem. I know where the small gem goes now. I know where it goes. Trying to figure out which one it was. I think it was this one then. Oh, it was that. There it is. Yeah. No, I didn't want to zoom in that far. Jesus Christ. And then this is jab right here. Yep. I knew it. Piece of flint. I see past lives, future lives, impossible lies. Hmm, what the hell does that even mean? Some sort of ring that comes through here. There's a trail of gunpowder in the trough near the chest. Maybe there's a whale. The trough in the chest. All the way down here. Gunpowder. Gunpowder. No. Does something fit on that seal barn? 
down like that. Didn't light a sucker up. Yep. How to light it on fire? Oh. There we go. It's on fire! Whoa. Whoa. It feels like Legends of the Hidden Temple or something. What the hell? There's some kind of mechanics about bars, but I can't reach it. Okay, Jesus Christ, I'm trying to back out. Stop giving me that freaking message. And then there's this statue or of something. There's a red splotch on there. No. Just tapping everywhere on this thing and it's not doing anything. You gotta move the wheel. What's behind those bars in the wall? Next clue said it's a sandbag, but I can't reach it. What's its counterbalance? What's it counterbalancing? All I do see is a symbol, but it's not complete. It's probably the wheel thing from the uh, the one of the boxes, but I don't know what that means. I can't see close enough. Yeah, maybe I can empty the sand back somehow is the uh, third clue.
it was something. Oh, it's the rage. So that won't come until later. What happens if we try the flint again? What happens if we do that? That's what I'm wondering. Oh, wait, I uh, can't do it anymore. Wah, wah, wah. Shooting the sandbag with the crossbow. Oh, I didn't think of that. You can place a bow there. this what's this I am blind as my reflection our gods do not live here this way brings no salvation this path is not for my people I shall seal them from it looks like Native American handwriting <laughs> A metal object with a star shape at either end. What? What was that? That was a bit over dramatic. But the metal star shape would be here. I know it's here. It's here. It's not? Are you serious? It's not. I thought for sure that would have been it. <sighs> Are you kidding me? Can't be that obvious. This would fit, but I can't. That's not nice. Shocked that it doesn't fit. The first clue said this is a metal object with a distinct shape. Can you close it off to make it a circle? I'm thinking maybe closer look. The metal object looks like it should fit into something. I know, but it's not fitting. It doesn't fit. 
So it does fit after all, it's just the wrong shape. The chest, there's a star-shaped socket inside of it. Ah, oh, the chest. I thought it was chest. Ch oh, right. I forgot about that. Those are clicking on the socket, you stupid. Stop clicking on those. Does that do anything? What does it do? I can't move it. I can't move it at all. What? I can't move it? Usually I'd be able to move it, but now for some reason I can't. Okay, so the first two clues were the metal object fits, but what now? And why are there two sockets in the chest? It constantly asks me something about the sockets. Do these sockets turn the thing? Man, this is hard. I wonder what closing and opening the chest could do. Whoa! Metal shard with a tick-ish hole in its center. So, does that fit the center thing at the box? Does no one Whoa. Trippy. Trippy shit right here. Whoa. Whoa. Oh my god, that is trippy. I know 
I think it also comes from the sandbag. If the sandbag is still up there, where's the sandbag? Oh. Those pins closed around the metal shard, it reminds me of a combination lock. A combination lock? Like a safe? I think you need to rotate the metal sh Yeah, no shit. How far all the way have to rotate this thing? Oh, I did it without even realizing it. What did that do? Skull. A human skull. What in the hell is behind there? Where would the skull fit? Jesus. And why do I even have a human skull? Uh, I think it might go in here? Here? I knew it. Ew. Oh. oh. Yes. It's that one again. Example or something. Oh. Right. right there. There's the door, and there's this Slender Man sort of thing comes out. What do I unlock now? You handled yourself well in the temple. May your good fortune be he a light to you as you navigate ever darker chambers. Um, but yeah, that is going to be it for the room two. But anyway, I hope you guys like this video. Give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel by clicking on that red subscribe button. And click on the notification bell to see every video that I will upload. And I'll see you folks in the next video. Bye bye.